What's up Empire Builders, JT Franco here and today I'm going to show you not only the most simple way to find a product but actually one of the most fun ways to find products to sell on Amazon. Now when I first discovered this it must have been about a year ago and it was a total accident. All right, I was in my room, I was typing away trying to find products and I was struggling. It was like the middle of the night and I was on a cold streak. I, was, I couldn't find any products for like the last three weeks. And then I heard my girlfriend in the other room laughing hysterically. I'm like, what the hell is going on? It's 11 p.m., what's so funny? I went outside, I checked out what she was watching on her phone, and when I saw the video that she was watching, boom, I had that light bulb moment and I knew, all right, I gotta try this, right? So I went in and it took me about a week. I was implementing this method, it took me about a week, and within that week, I found a product that I still sell to this day that makes me $5,000 every single month in profit. So I'm sure you're wondering now, what was she watching and what was my big idea? That's what you're gonna find out in today's video. Don't be 99% of people that never take action. Your empire awaits. All right, so this method is really close to my heart because like I said, it saved me from a rut, it saved me from product research burnout, and it got me one of my most consistently selling products. Now, uh, it's only gonna take me two minutes to show you this method. Now, if you don't have two minutes, that's okay. Go ahead, go back to the conventional methods of finding products, but if you wanna find out one of the best ways and one of the most enjoyable ways to find products to sell on Amazon, then make sure you stick with me and make sure you smash that like button right now uh, so we can jump right into it. So here we go, uh, what you gotta do, all right, what she was watching, first you gotta go to youtube.com. So the way we're gonna find products today is by literally watching videos on YouTube like you are doing right now. All right, so we are on YouTube now, and what you're gonna do, the first thing you're gonna do is go ahead and click that subscribe button, right? And then next, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the search bar, and we're gonna look um, for the subcategory, there's an entire market uh, of people uh, that are looking for weird products. So that's what my girlfriend was watching. Uh, she was watching a YouTuber testing weird products online, right? And I realized that there's this entire market for people that are looking for products that are putting it onto their channels just to get laughs and just to get, you know, for the fun of it, but really as sellers, we can sneak in there and see if any of those products are profitable and worth actually pursuing. So we're gonna go ahead and search like uh, testing weird, and then you go first thing, testing weird products, right? And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna notice that some of these are just by, they're, they're usually ranked in order of like most views or most subscribers, so uh, obviously 4.1 4 million views, 5 million views. So we're gonna go ahead and filter this uh, by the month. So if we filter by the month, you know it's something uh, that is relevant, uh, relatively new at least. Um, it's not just b based on who has the most views. So let's go ahead and just click on the first one here, okay? Testing weird things I bought from Wish. So again, it doesn't have to be products from Amazon. It can just be any products online uh, and we're just gonna test if they are relatable to Amazon. So usually, sometimes if we're lucky, the best part about this method is that people will put it in the description, like what products they bought, um, and unfortunately she didn't do that, but sometimes they'll just be like, all the products that are tested will be in the description of the video. So I've seen this product on Amazon before. Uh, it's the ab stimulator thing. And if they don't have it, I'm literally just gonna fast forward through the video and look at the parts when they are, you know, looking for products. And we're gonna play it, see what she's talking about here. All right, so it's like an ab stimulator thing, right? So what you do literally is just take that, go to Amazon and go to ab stimulator. So we found it on Amazon, here it is, the Ab Simulator, right? That's the product that she was testing, uh, but it's very important first to make sure you have the right keyword. So we are here in Viral Launch, uh, Viral Launch Keyword Research Tool. This is important because um, you need to know what the main keyword is for your product. Stimulator. So we're gonna search this up and I'll show you exactly, if you've never used this before, exactly how this works, right? Because um, sometimes you might think it's the, the best word for the product, but it's actually not. So here you can see Ab Okay, I put simulator, obviously that's not <laughs> the right one. Stimulator 14,000, so that is the right one. So, so you can see the difference in this. If I was to think, hey, that's an ab toner, and I just use ab toner as the keyword, and it's, the volume estimate is only 1,600, then the, the, the amount of traffic going to that is gonna be very different than the you know, ab stimulator, uh, which are gonna be very different results when you're judging you know, sales and, and reviews and everything like that. So this is the number one thing. We're gonna pull the viral launch market intelligence dropdown, and this is where we can get all the stats. So if you don't have viral launch yet, I would suggest getting it. It is one of the most important tools, like the, the, the one tool really that I use all the time for product research, uh, because you got your keyword research tool, and then you got your market intelligence tool, which is the drop down, and all of that is included. Uh, the link's in the description. I have a discount code, lifetime discount code. So if you buy monthly, uh, then you get a lifetime discount every single month uh, for Viral Launch. All right, so right off the bat, you got a product idea score of five stars out of five stars, and we're gonna look at this, right? So 
we got 42,000 revenue, 23 reviews. And we're looking for, you know, high revenue, less reviews means a lot of demand, low competition. So anything under like 150 reviews is great. And all these guys are doing under that 50 reviews, 23 reviews, three reviews, and they're killing it, right? $7,000 a month, $21,000 a month, $8,000, $33,000 a month with really low reviews. And this is just off the first product that literally we found in like three minutes, right? So this is how exactly how this method works. And you're just going to keep going um, and going and going and looking through these videos and see if there's anything else. So that's just we got lucky with the first one, and I've seen this product around for you know a while. So let's see if there's anything else we can find on YouTube uh, that is not something that has been around for centuries. So let's go back, and we're gonna go ahead and change the search term. And what I would usually do when I'm actually doing this method, I would go through every single thing on the first page, uh, try them all out, and then I would change the search term. Uh, but just for the sake of this video, we will keep flying through. All right. So what's next? We're gonna look for. Let's try weird products on Amazon, right? And we're gonna do the same exact thing. We're gonna filter by this month uh, so that we get relevant results and let's just scroll and usually I just I, I avoid these ones the ones with like RS those are um, Indian channels so you don't want to get those Weird Amazon beauty. Oh, here. So this is another thing about this method that's really great is you can search by niche, right? So if you know you want to get into kitchen or if you want to get into beauty, you can do weird beauty products. And there's people that do just that. Weird kitchen products, weird office products on Amazon. And you can actually search the videos uh, by the exact the place that you want to sell, right? So let's try weird products on Amazon. Hopefully, if we're lucky, they will list them in the description. Boom. So here we go. That's exactly what I'm talking about. People are listing their products in the description because it's probably an affiliate link. Actually, these don't look like they are, but if they're smart, they would be affiliate links. Uh, so that would be making money, right? So let's go ahead. Portable juicer, reusable metal straws. Um, see something fake eyelashes, magnetic eyelashes. Okay. Let's try magnetic eyelashes. Cause that's something I've never heard of in my life. Magnetic eyelashes. And there you go, there's the link right to it, right? So it kind of looks like it's, okay, this is Amazon UK. So first things first, remember guys, always look for the keyword. Eyelashes. So magnetic eyelashes, Violent's gonna tell me what the best search term is. 62,000 searches for magnetic eyelashes, um, magnetic lashes, so that is the number one search term. So let's go ahead and grab this and you can actually just Click the button right here, view it on Amazon, and it'll automatically go to Amazon.com, right? And then we can pull the viral launch drop down again. Now, some of you use Jungle Scout, I know, and that's fine. So I'll use Jungle Scout. I have them both. As I was saying, I always like to uh, use as much, get as much data as I can because both viral launch and Jungle Scout are showing you estimates. So I like to cross reference them. Um, but if you're just going to choose one, choose viral launch because it has the all encompassing suite. But for those of you that are familiar with Jungle Scout, I will just pull the Jungle Scout drop down for you just for this video so you can kind of, you know, it's more familiar to you. Um, so it's easier for you to kind of grasp it, switch back and forth, and let this load in. That's the one thing about Jungle Scout. Sometimes it's, it's a little slower. All right, so it loaded in and boom, we have another product that I would definitely look deeper into. So we have these guys that are outliers, right? They have killer reviews. It looks like the one brand that's really probably invented it, the Dio Verde or whatever that is. Uh, but then you got these guys, zero reviews, $42,000. Four reviews, $56,000 every single month. And what we're looking for is the, the depth of the market, right? How, like where can you fit into the mix? Uh, and if you get into the middle, can you be profitable? You don't always have to gun for the top spot, right? So you don't have to look at this guy and say, oh, it's too competitive because I can never beat the guy with 900 reviews. You can instead look at it in terms of where can you fit in and if you can fit in there, how can you be profitable, right? And there's a lot of people in here under 100 reviews that are making absolute killings, right? 75 reviews, uh, 29,000. 30,000, 30,000 with four reviews. So this looks like a market that's definitely something to look into uh, because as we scroll down, even down, down, down to the bottom of the page, we still got guys with like, you know, can, if you fit in somewhere here where you're making $6,000 a month, is that enough? Because I bet you these magnetic lashes don't cost that, cost that much to source, right? So there you go, two videos in, uh, we got two products already. Now I wanna do mention one thing about this method is that it's not just about trying to find the products uh, here on, on, on YouTube, right? What you can do, what I usually do with this is I'll use this as kind of the starting point. So if you look at it like a, like Plinko, right? You have, if you know Plinko or you, it's just like a funnel, right? I'll just less obscure, uh, like a funnel. This is the top of the funnel and we're looking at, okay, reusable magnetic fake eyelashes, right? And we're here. What I'll usually do is I'll click into a listing. 
So I, this product is great. I, it looks like, okay, this is something I can get into, but now we can use this and use Amazon's own web of data to, to see what else we can pull from it. So we got the magnetic lashes and then I'll go into like the frequently bought together or the sponsored products that are related and that aren't exactly the same product. And we'll actually just start digging and digging and see, okay, magnetic lashes is one thing. Is there anything related to this? Like what is this? Uh, castor oil for eyelashes. So now we'll go in and look to another product and we'll go back to the viral launch um, tool. So we'll go castor oil, right? I have no idea what that is. Viral launch says 53,000 searches every single month for this product, right? So now we'll go ahead and click this button again, open it up in um, Amazon. And now we're looking for castor oil and we're gonna do the same exact thing. We're gonna pull the drop down and see how this product looks. So that's how it goes guys, right? We've been on this video for a few minutes now. We already found a product that does $50,000 every single month, uh, two products actually, uh, the ab stimulator, it's like $40,000 every single month. And then we got these magnetic eyelashes, which are absolutely really killing it. You saw how it went down the list. 30, 50, $60,000 every single month with sub 75 reviews, right? And we're using this now to look for similar products in the range. Uh, and we're gonna see what Violanch says here. All right, so Violanch opened up and I would not touch this product. Um, it, a lot of revenue, but crazy, crazy reviews down the line. Um, and as it dips, uh, less reviews, less revenue, right? 500, uh, so I probably wouldn't get into that, but that is how I would use this method to find similar products to what we found on Amazon or what we found on YouTube. So that is literally the method, right? I clicked on two or three videos and we found products that we can actually already go ahead and dig deeper and pursue. So hopefully you see the value in this method. Literally, you're going to YouTube, you're watching YouTube videos, they lay it out for you typically in the description. All you gotta do is click on it, look at the viral or the viral launch market or keyword research tool, make sure it's the number one keyword and then put it onto Amazon and see the results and you can sit and watch YouTube and literally make money doing it. And if you want more info on how, what you would do after this step, right? Because this is just the top of the funnel. What's the next step and the step after that, make sure you join and register for my free um, online seminar that I'm hosting. It's about an hour long where I go through the three pillars that I use to build my Amazon business from start to finish uh, and the three top secrets that are really blowing up the businesses of everyone that I show it to. And if you want to join that seminar, make sure you click in the link in the description uh, and register while the seats are available because it will not be up forever. We are going to be removing it. So make sure you join while you still can to get real, real detailed information um, and make sure that you go ahead and implement this research method today to go and get you out of rut, find your first product, find your next product, whatever it may be. And lastly, click that like button and click this video over here to get more product research. Click my face to subscribe to this channel um, and then click the bottom again for that free masterclass seminar. I'm JT Franco and I will see you in the next one. I am